What I've noticed is that near the lakefront, it's significantly cooler, has been, and that breeze that's coming off that good old beautiful lake right there, <laughs> it's definitely <laughs> got a bite to it. You get out into the burbs, very different. So today, this picture that you're looking at right here, anybody who lives that where we can see, will be in the 50s today, maybe low 60s if you're lucky, whereas away from the city, we may flirt with 80 degrees, so some massive changes depending on where you are. Right now it's 59 degrees at Gary as well as Waukegan, 65 degrees around O'Hare. So let's talk about the other thing that we've got to deal with, and that's the potential for showers and storms. You can see when that begins, and it's really after about 4 o'clock today. We'll see temperatures climbing, instability rising, and then boom, those showers and storms turn on and they get going into the afternoon. And evening again. Right now, we're looking pretty good, nice and dry, but the bigger picture will show there's a bit of activity already back on off to the west. Some of that may die out as it progresses eastward, but there's much more where that came from, a little bit stronger, and that works in a little bit later on this afternoon. So, watch here. Boom, there we go. This is at 8 o'clock tonight. Showers, storms, potential for severe weather, though, looks to be more so down in this neck of the woods, down in the slight risk area, but this is some pretty good thunderstorm activity and possibly some severe weather in the mix here as well. That progresses eastward. This line looks fairly strong as it progresses away from our area. So we're really going to need to keep an eye on this whole situation into the afternoon. The potential for severe weather is definitely there today. That activity moves away, and we're left with just a little scattered shower activity potentially early Thursday. Looking much better by Thursday afternoon and Friday, Saturday, Sunday. All expected at this point to be relatively dry. So Storm Prediction Center had this slight risk area bumped up a little bit, and the marginal risk area bumped up a little bit, but they've pushed it down to the south a touch. And that's uh, good news for us, but we're still very close to the risk area or in the risk area. Some of our counties have been excluded now, but basically we're in the marginal risk for most of Chicagoland with a slight risk area just to our south. So again, all eyes to the sky. Weather radio is absolutely switched to on for the afternoon and evening. And you're probably okay until about 4 o'clock, and then after that we start to look for the potential. We've got 59 degrees the high in Chicago, 58 Zion, but take a peek. Whoa, Kankakee almost 80, 77 Juliet. So if you're in Chicago and Zion and you really have a hankering for 70, 80 degree temperatures, just get in the car, drive uh, south or west. You'll run into them pretty quickly here today. We're going to find a difference in where we are depending on what your high temperature is today. And then, of course, we've got those showers and storms, potential for some isolated or maybe perhaps a bit more than that, severe weather-wise. So we'll see how this uh, plays out this afternoon. But by Mother's Day weekend, we're great. Sunny and 72. We will take it. All right, Megan, thank you.